Hey there, turn on your speakers. Do you have finals week coming up? Projects due? Homeworks are piling up? Are you freaking out that you're getting boxed in with deadlines? Here's an idea get help. Think Geek Exams. Find us on Facebook, Twitter, or YouTube. So this is the eighth, uh, eighth part of uh, problem D. And this one has to deal with uh, weighted mean squared error. And basically there is uh, uh, observed value and an expected value, um, a predicted value. And x of i is the observed value, x of hat of i is the predicted value. And there are weights, and we take the uh, s square of the difference between the two and multiply that by the weight, and then uh, divide that by the sum of the weights. And uh, we, can, we can do that over here. Uh, let's, let's copy this. It's going to be B. D8, D8, D8. Okay, so all we need to do here is define the function. So it's called WMS, and it's a function. So I'm going to call a function, and it takes uh, x observed. Let's call it XO, comma, XP, that's predicted, and then W. These are the three uh, vectors that it takes. And then uh, we are, we're going to have a numerator and a denominator. So we'll calculate the numerators first. So numerator, numer, not numberator, numerator is uh, sum of um, x observed minus x predicted and I'm going to put that in a parenthesis and then square that and then multiply this by w that should do the trick and let's call the denominator in here denominator denom denominator and it's just the sum of w's so that's now result is numerator again I wrote numberator <laughs> numerator uh, denominator and that should give you the result so we return the result that should be final and that's the end of this one so now that we have defined WMS function, we are told that we need to check this WMS function for predicted values of these vectors and observed values of these vectors and weights of these vectors. So let's start coding it in. Uh, X. So let's do that. Let's uh, first number our number and comment. Okay. So we're doing D9. So over here, x of o is told to be uh, c 0.13 comma 0.79 and x of t equals to c 0.1 comma 0.8 and w equals to C 0 0.05 comma 0 0.3 so these values you can see right here the first one is this one 
the second one is this one, and the third one is this one. So the once we have these vectors, we can now call uh, WMS function. So let's uh, let's call it um, weight, weighted mean squared. Let's call it weighted mean squared. WMS first is x of o, comma x of t, comma w. And that should give us our weighted means, weighted mean squares. And now uh, we need to check the values. So cat weighted ms equals to comma weighted ms comma okay so let's let's test it out let's see what happens and the weighted ms is over here 0 0.000214 we're going to try that out over here so the first values are x of o which are i i already wrote the code here to save some time uh, this is an Excel. We're testing it against uh, hand calculated values in Excel. So x of t is 0 0.1 and 0 0.8. And then w's are 0 0.05 and 0 0.3. And, and voila, 0 0.000214. And that is the same number as we see. So this is 0 0.00214, this is 0 0.000214, they're both the same number. So we have, so these warning signs are from the graphs that we did before, and they're just saying that 12 rows, uh, rows that had uh, uh, missing information that have been removed. So they're, they're just data missing, so that we couldn't print those points. So that's a trivial case. So onwards to the last problem, D10. So the next problem is so big that we are going to make a completely separate video. Uh, so D10 is going to be on a different video altogether. Uh, so uh, we're going to stop this video here and uh, see you for the next video on, yeah, see you in the next video. Thank you. Think Geek Exams. Our agents have Masters of Engineering degrees from MIT, Stanford, Georgia Tech, Caltech. We give you solutions to mathematics, physics, computing, and engineering. Find us on Facebook, Twitter, or YouTube.